This is Mr. Mega Man Fan, and today I'm going to get out some games from Japan, but instead of just showing you them, I'm going to actually play them for a few seconds on this Game Boy Light, and you can see what they are in action. So, without further ado, let's get this package open. Cut through these mini layers of tape that have been put on here to keep it safe in transit. And we'll go through these one at a time. And uh, I got four games. This one appears to be the Pro Wrestling game, which I believe was just called Pro Wrestling. Let's see how it looks. Yep, that's definitely pro wrestling, but I don't know the move sets, so I'm not going to get very far here. I'm not going to be able to do anything really spectacular, so I'll have to look up some instructions and delve back into that one a little later. <laughs> and uh, I believe this one is the Shogi game, which is a strategy game with tile pieces. Three of these were only 99 cents each, and one of them was three bucks, so I thought that was a pretty good deal, all things considered. And yes, that's Shogi, or Shoji, I'm not sure of the pronunciation, and I apologize for butchering it. I don't know the rules, so this one too I'll have to look up, but I gather that it's something like chess, where... You have pieces that are stronger than other pieces, and the pieces get, that can capture other pieces. Kind of that deal. Alright. Number three. I believe this is Super Chinese Land. The name alone intrigued me. I had to know what the heck that was, so... I wonder if it's like a platforming type of game. I'm guessing it probably is. Just based on that scroll. Uh, okay. It's not a left or right scroller. It's like a full screen battler, kind of. Uh, okay. I'm going to have to look up the rules for that, too, but... That looks interesting. And the last one will be the easiest to understand. You may have seen the Jeremy Parrish channel, the Game Boy World channel, cover this one. It's Twin B Da. Like I said, this one was only a few bucks. Probably because of the mangled top label. But I care about a working game more than a perfect label, so... Let's see this in action. And there we go. Twinby. It's a shooter game where the power ups look like bells. It's a little hard to play this while filming. I'm looking through one screen at another screen, so. Familiar Konami sound effects there. I'll have to play that more off camera, but. That's my haul. Four Japanese games, and I would say the highlights of the four are probably going to be Super Chinese Land and Twin B Da.